donating used clothes and items not only helps people who can't afford them, it also helps the earth. Jessica Thompson and Joseph Zawicki from Sabres Thrift Store here to talk about how you can reuse clothes to help support the YWCA Emergency Shelter. Welcome to the show, you guys. Hi. Hey. So <laughs> tell us what's happened. How do we get you? I mean, I would, we can get you guys clothes, but then you guys do what with them? Donate them or? Um, we recycle them. Um, we put them out, out for reuse. Um, a lot of people come in and buy them to uh, recreate pieces, which is really cool. Um, we found um, a lot of people don't realize how much textiles are actually going into the landfills every year. Um, last year in April, Savers did a, uh, a report about consumption mm -hmm. um, and reuse, and they found that 26 billion pounds of textiles and clothing go into the landfills every year. Wow. Uh, about 10.5 uh, million pounds of that is clothing that should be able to be reused. They say about 95% of that they think is able f to be reused. Wow. So that's quite a staggering amount of things that if you just take a little bit of time, drop them off at our local center, center we'll give you a coupon um, you can use to purchase goods in the store. Um, and it just really, really helps the environment to keep all of that clothing out of those landfills. We pay the local YWCA for those donations that come through as well. So not only are you helping the planet, you're also helping the local community here as well. Wow. And wait, so wait, what do you mean you pay the YWCA? How does it work? Uh, so every um, clothing or household items, jewelry, furniture, whatever you bring to our store, um, we'll pay them based off the weight of those goods. Um, so that way they're getting some money and you're helping to fund all of their wonderful programs there at the shelter. Um, and then you can have a you know, nice little feel good there. Wow. I love it too because sometimes it's nice when you can donate some of your items, but then you do go in the store and you realize just how many choices and options there are inside of there. I know I've gone there not only around Halloween time is one of my favorites because I get to dress up, but you can go in there and look for that special occasion dress that you don't want to spend $100 on, you could spend 20 on instead. That's what's great about you guys. Absolutely. This year I made an ugly sweater dress instead Ooh. of an ugly sweater. Um, that was really fun to use an old prom dress mm -hmm. as a Christmas tree dress. And let's talk about the bags too because Joseph you have a new bag there. Yeah. Um, so we're going to be promoting over the uh, next couple months to get rid of plastic bags. Mm -hmm. um, it's a huge waste in our um, community across the whole planet. The, uh, America uses about I think it's uh, 100 billion plastic bags every year. Uh, the average household takes home 1,500 themselves. Um, it's, it's just a huge waste, and it takes over 500 years for those plastic bags to degrade. So by August, company-wide, Savers is ditching plastic, and uh, we're going to try to promote using reusable tote bags and also swapping to paper bags. Wow. Yeah. That's nice. So you go in, they'll, you, do we buy that? Um, they're for sale for 99 cents, mm -hmm. um, and then once Earth Month is coming up on the 22nd, we'll be giving them away for... Um, free if you make a purchase of $50 or more. Wow. Nice. Yeah. And I do want to mention though, because we've been talking about donating your used clothes, that doesn't mean the ones with the armpit stains and the holes in them should be donated. So when people are kind of looking through their closet, what are some items that you most need or do look for? Honestly, even those items of clothing, those can get recycled. So we encourage you to even donate those items also, because they can always find another use. Wow. So like you cut them up and sew something else or what do you mean? Um, yep, you can cut them up and sew them, sew them into something else. A lot of people buy um, textiles to make rags. Mm. Um, you've seen people make rag rugs. There's just all kinds of things you never would have imagined you could do. I bet Pinterest would be a good yeah. one to use yeah. too, especially during Earth Month and like you said, Earth Day is coming up. So it'd be kind of a fun time to look for different projects that your family could take part in. Pinterest actually has a great, um, you can make a reusable cloth bag out of a t-shirt. So then you could use it when you're shopping at yeah. Savers. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Let's remind people when you guys are open so that they can come by, drop off their donations. Uh, we're open 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. Monday through Saturday and noon to 7 on Sundays. Um, there should always be a donation attendant there to be able to help you unload anything that you can't unload and to give you a coupon. Can I have... remind them where you're located at too? Sorry. We're uh, right next to Best Buy, right on the frontage road there. I have a trunk full of stuff that I'm ready to take over there. <laughs> That's what I was going to say. I even said, do you want to yeah, come back to my car real quick? <laughs>
But he was like, yeah, I'll take it right yeah, now. Let's take it now. <laughs> okay. Well, I'll go no, to my deal. car after the show. <laughs> Thanks, you guys. We appreciate yeah. it. Absolutely. Thank All you. right, stay with us. We're going to wrap up Friday's show right after this.